one. What's up, viewers, subscribers, and other people alike? It's your boy, Light Lucifer and Friends, coming to show once again with the Tower, Garden Tower, Part 3. And we're just walking y'all through the process of how this works in regards to, you know, self sustainability and gardening and so forth and so on in regards to what's necessary. What's necessary for, you know, social sustainability. <laughs> now, what we are doing is showing you that basically, when you, before you start your process of growing your uh, vegetables and so forth, you actually have what's called rockwood cubes, okay? Let them soak for 30 minutes in pure water, all right? You soak for 30 minutes in pure water. And as I said before, we're going to go into pH test if you can use your pH test you can use your acid because you're gonna have to fill the base up with water but we're not gonna put the cart before the horse now what you do is you have starter seeds you have your starter seeds now I did say in my previous video oh my God. <laughs> go ahead <laughs> they just will not leave it's all right. So We're outside. So basically, you basically had your starter seeds. Now, I did say in my previous video, got a neighbor. basically, um, it's you can use whatever you want. You can actually use your own seeds. You can use your own seeds. It's perfectly fine. You can use your own seeds. All right? So, correction. You can use your own seeds. You don't have to purchase them from the website. You can use your own seeds. I prefer that you use heirloom seeds. Heirloom seeds, you'll find them. You'll actually be surprised because at Dollar General, they actually do sell heirloom seeds. Or if you buy seed uh, fruits with seeds, you can keep the seeds from the fruits that you buy. So it's like your money is, is invested in investment and investment and investment. Think about that. Now, what you do is, you take your starter seeds and you place them in the rockwood cubes, okay? Rock wool cubes. And then you take the vermiculite and you spread a little bit on top, okay? Now, this goes into this section of the, the tower. Now, you have to decide whether you want to keep it inside or outside, you know? I would prefer inside because we have the UV um, attachment. But again, you can't just move this around, just like, you know, just up and down, move it around. Depending on the season, if you feel like you want to move it, it all depends. I mean, this is going to become quite heavy in regards to, you know, the. Uh, the actual process of actually having this full. This is this is this is quite it's quite maneuverable when it's because it's not full. But you have to fill this you have to fill this all the way up. You know what I'm saying? You have to fill this all the way up. And we're gonna show you how to do the pump system. Son of a <laughs> you go ahead to do the pump system. And we're going to show you how to actually, uh, I'm multitasking, y'all. I'm sorry. Hey, y'all forget the camera I'm not camera going to re record this. I'm, 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 I'm not. Right? <laughs> you also have, you have baby greens, which you can actually put inside of an additional. We didn't soak this one yet. But you can actually have, we soak these in the rock wool part. And what you can do is basically just start with your germination tray and you can you can get the process rolling. You know, but let me let me include this point. You cannot, you cannot, you cannot put the sproutlings into the actual tower itself until they begin to grow. Until they begin to grow. Okay. Once they begin to grow, that's when you can start putting them in. So it's a slow process, but it's a great process. 
but it's a process nonetheless, okay? So again, it's a process. So walk with me and Latoya in this process. We're gonna show y'all the actual benefits of it. And we're gonna walk y'all on how to take care of the machine as well. Because you have to you have to have proper maintenance as well on the on the tower as well. And you have to make sure that you know exactly what you're doing because if you invest in this, you have to know what you're doing. You need to know what you're doing. And if you don't know what you're doing, then what's the, what's the investment for? So we're just walking y'all through the, uh, the process of how this works. But it's pretty simple if you follow directions, to be honest with you. It's pretty simple. It's pretty simple <laughs> if you follow directions, okay? And yes, we will show y'all basically, if she say, it was like, helicopter. <laughs> Guys, it's like. <laughs> Today is a great day. You know, we decide to record and come outside, and this is what happens outside. Now, we're gonna show y'all um, the mineral. Next, we're gonna show y'all about the mineral blends A and B. And we're gonna, like I said, we're gonna walk y'all through the process so you can familiarize yourself with this if you want to invest in this for yourself. And want to invest in it for yourself? Cool. Y'all stay safe. I'll be 